Minecraft. A game played by millions around the world. It would be hard to count the amount of days that gamers everywhere have been playing this fantastic game. But do they truly know what happens in the world of Minecraft? So today we're going to be starting by taking a closer look at the wildlife of Minecraft. Since the beginning, sheep have been a common occurrence. For a long time, sheep were only there as some kind of fluffy being to provide us with wool that wasn't really able to do anything. They'd usually go about their day without interrupting you. This, however, changed with the first appearance of beds in Minecraft Beta 1.3. Players were encouraged to slaughter the animals in hope that they drop wool. Getting the wool and crafting it in a certain recipe would allow you to build a bed. And as long as there aren't any monsters around, this allows you to sleep through the cold, lonely nights. As most people are well aware, being out in the night time, not always the brightest thing to do. It was always a struggle to try and make it through to the next day. But thankfully, because of beds, we can now sleep easy. But that didn't make this method acceptable. But thankfully, man created shears. Shears were first introduced into beta 1.7 and allowed the user to strip the sheep of his wool without doing any harm to the sheep. It was an extremely effective and much more sheep-friendly method. Sheep everywhere rejoiced. They killed me, brother! They killed him in cold blood just for his wo- Over the many updates Minecraft has received, sheep have become more essential to our survival. The night is a truly dangerous thing, and we must protect anything that makes it easier. Minecraft has very mysterious and magical creatures living within it, and I intend to go through with you some of my favorites. Some live on the surface and are easy to find. Some of the others may be a little bit more difficult to find. Just remember, a sheep is important to our survival. It allows us to make it through the harsh night, to live another day. Though they are jolly good fun to blow up, I must say. 